all have learned the argument is principle. But did you know there is an interesting story behind them? That is the story of Archimedes' bath incident. Let's take a look to the story. Archimedes is born in 287 BC. He is a great physicist, mathematician, astronomer as well as inventor. One day, he is summoned by the king in order to investigate whether he is cheated by goldsmith or not. King told that he had given the exact amount of gold that is required to make the crown. But when the crown is ready, King have a doubt, might the goldsmith have cheated him? King asked the Archimedes to solve out the problem, but without causing any damage to the crown. One day, while he is taking his bath, he noticed that water level rises up and it overflows, while he immersed himself into the water. This realized that how much water is released depends upon how much he is immersed into the water. This discovery excited him so much that he directly jumped from the tub and ran to the king. Well, he found the way to solve out the problem. He just needed to calculate the density of the crown and compare it to the density of pure gold. We know that the density is the measurement of mass divided by volume. As well as the density of pure gold is much more than the silver. So Archimedes just needed to calculate the density of crown for which he needed to measure the mass of crown and then the volume of crown. But measuring the volume of crown is not so easy due to its irregular shape. We can measure the volume of cube and sphere, such simple shapes, but not of the irregular shape. The solution he realized is to put the crown into the water and then measure the volume of the displaced water, which must be equal to the volume of the crown. In this way, he can calculate the volume as well as the density of the crown. Now, if the crown density is found to be less than goldsmith must have cheated. The same experiment done in front of the king and find the same result. The crown density found to be less. It means goldsmith have cheated and he was punished by the king. In this way, Archimedes complete his experiment and give his Archimedes principle. So this causes the formation of Archimedes principle. Thank you for watching. If you have any query related to physics, you can leave a comment or you can visit my website, the link is provided in the description.